homemade ice cream. Janet uh, requested we do peach. So we have about two pints of peaches that I froze with no sugar. We're gonna let that fall. But meanwhile, if you wanna make homemade ice cream and wanna make it freeze quicker, it's better to mix it up and put it in the refrigerator. So what do we have in here? One cup of milk, I mean, excuse me, one cup of white granulated sugar and a dub dub of vanilla. Right, that's the vanilla we were using. That's correct. The vanilla paste. We're gonna add one can of Eagle Bran or sweet condensed milk. Yes, I asked for the peach ice cream. Because Andy's favorite too. One I, can of evaporated milk. I wanted that because I just think that the fruit down south is probably juicier and mm. sweeter and more flavorful. Well, and this is peach season right now. Yeah, and I just thought that would be southern. And the other day I got to eat a Georgia peach and wow, that was, mm -hmm. that was White peach. A white peach, yeah. Mm -hmm. If you want to stir that, I'm going to add in heavy whipping cream. And then we're going to refrigerate this. When we get home this afternoon, we're going to add whole milk. And we're going to add, we're going to put the uh, half of these peaches in a blender and mm -hmm. blend them up. And then the other half we're going to chop up. So basically, it's not going to be in the ice cream maker until later, later today. that's correct. And then we'll be putting it in the freezer around what time? Oh, um, you mean to actually turn it? Well, so that it would be cold, like ice cream? Oh, yeah, eat. probably about seven, and then it'll be fresh. Okay. Like, how long do you have to have it in the freezer? Oh, in the fridge? We're going to put it in the fridge all day. Oh, We're okay. going to put it in the old, old White Mountain freezer and turn it with ice and rock salt. Oh, I remember mm -hmm. doing that when I was a kid on my exactly. grandfather's farm. Yeah. How's that? And then here's the key to seeing if it's sweet enough, Janet. And I know you're, you're not a sweet freak like me, but this is the, the test. And it is. Mm, delicious. Yeah. We could make it just like that. You know, you could put any flavor you want in it. Right. Mm -hmm. This is the base. It's the base. This is the base, and then you're gonna add the, we're gonna add the peaches. That's later correct. On. Okay. Let's refrigerate this and this will be part of our Southern Throwdown Showdown. I'm night. excited on the great Southern food. This will actually be great with a piece of pound cake. <laughs> Why can't I get a little? It's not the right size. No, it, it stretches. Is. I've had this thing for 30 something years. <laughs> you know what? I think you're right. I think this is not gonna fit. Let's just put some plastic wrap, right? some press and seal, and then Cookie's gonna go night night and we're gonna go out to Smith Farms and do a little veggie shopping. We'll take you guys along. We may have to put this in the fridge outside. We're out of room in here. And there we have it. Excellent. Okay. So, for cooking, cutting up, and keeping it real, yep. it's Janet and Lisa. See ya. See ya. Bye. Will you push that button right there, buddy?